again, that was amazing. That was amazing. I, I'm still focusing, like I said at the beginning of the week, we're, we're upping the ante. We're always going to be upping the ante and, and challenging you uh, to challenge yourself. That's really what this boils down to at, at its very core. It's a challenge for you to challenge you. That's, that's, that's what it is. That's what it is at, at, its, at its most basic. Um, but it's something that's so powerful and strong when you're able to, you know, set a goal. And, you know, members who have never been able to do a sit-up or a push-up before or hold their plank for longer than 10 seconds, okay, are now doing planks up off the wall, okay, are doing push-ups, are doing sit-ups, are doing crunches, like it's nobody's business. It's the, it's the challenge that challenges you to be better. It challenges you to be stronger. Um, that's actually not what I wanted to talk about. Like I got a little bit of a tangent right there. Um, what I wanted to talk to you guys about is this, All right? Not your brain, literally this, the hat, okay? Hat. Um, we wear, a lot of us, because I, you know, I, I'm proud to say, I'm honored to say that I've gotten to know quite a few many of you, you know, as time has gone by. And we wear a lot of hats in our daily lives. You know, we wear the hats of, of mothers and fathers, we're the hats of sons and daughters, brothers and sisters, uncles and aunts, cousins. We wear the hats of small business owners and, and executives at major major companies and, you know, a whole bunch of work hats. We're, we're entrepreneurs and, you know, everything under the sun. It's, you guys wear a lot of hats, a lot of powerful hats, by the way. A lot of hats that you should be proud to wear and keep in your closet in like a special hat compartment or something like that. So we wear a lot of hats. Uh, the hat that we probably wear more than, than anything else, though, and it's one we not even we don't even think about. It's a firefighter's hat. <laughs> it's a firefighter's hat. You know, big red with the maybe a little siren on the top just for like aesthetics. But it's a it's a it's a firefighter hat um, because we spend a lot of our days putting out fires, all right, and fixing things that go wrong in our day, fixing fires, adjusting things, focusing on things that that spring up at the last minute and, and catch us by surprise and and. Again, we're, we're firefighters. That's another one of our jobs. Just tack it onto the list. The list is always, always growing. Now we're now some of us are teachers because we're helping our kids be, you know, with homeschooling, and we're teachers now too. Um, that firefighter hat that we wear though is very important. Okay, it's very important because it's something that adds to your stress level. All right, constantly having to fix things and 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 be there to fix things and have the wherewithal to fix things and, and you know all the things that are going on in our lives, you know, in our lives. I want you guys to focus on yourself. I reminded you of this yesterday, and this kind of coincides with that you belong up on that mural power talk that I gave yesterday. Um, the things that I want you to be fixing, okay, and I don't even look at it as fixing, the things I want you to be improving upon, all right, they're all in here. Wait, let me put that down. Right in here and right up here. Because if we get this right, if we get this pumping the right way and running off the right fuel and just firing on all cylinders, hey, all this stuff, right here, okay, right here, and every other muscle in our body, including our brain, is gonna start to improve, all right? And then those same, you know, fires that, that might emerge that we have to put out with our firefighter hat, we're now able and better equipped to handle them because of the time that you're taking to focus on you and improve upon the amazing person that is you, all right? And, and make sure that you are in the right headspace and that you are, you know, in a positive mindset and that you are you know viewing the world as glass half full and not glass half empty because there are so many beautiful things in this world so many beautiful things and i know a couple hundred of them because they're my maxers just some of the most beautiful people in this world we work out with them every single day every single day and if you're watching this you are one of them <laughs> you're one of them um focus on the beauty in things all right find the beauty in things and we're gonna we're gonna slowly find that those fires are not so urgent after all. And we have the wherewithal to handle them one fire at a time, one at a time, all right? And we're gonna do it because we've gotten stronger here and stronger everywhere else. So that being said, um, I'm not gonna make a funny face because you guys took some like horrendously hilarious pictures of me yesterday and, or the day before that, and let's just not do that again. So I'm just gonna give you a smile. I'm gonna put my fist nice and close. We're gonna say, take it to the max on three again. You wanna take a picture with me? Take a picture with me. Let's post it for taking one of these on-demand classes, all right? So let's say, take it to the max on three nice and loud. Thank you for pushing, all right? Thank you for giving it everything you got. It means a lot to me, all right? Thank you for taking this class. I'll see you tomorrow for some kickboxing.
one, two, three. Take it to the max. Have a great rest of your day. Way to stay strong, all right? I will see you guys soon. Drink some water. Have some protein. Take care, everybody. Adios. See you guys soon.